Welcome. This is the energy vibration reading for the Sun, Moon, and Rising Capricorns. This is the um, sixth week of uh, the year 2018. And um, we are um, in the week of the. Um, that is the <laughs> um, star. Yeah, the star. So um, it is the zodiac energy of hair. The week begins from the 5th until the 11th. So this is going to be wonderful. Okay, so let's go ahead and see what is actually happening and what is actually transpiring in this week for you Capricorns. And Monday, you have the energy of the lover on Monday. This is wonderful. This is good because there is going to be a situation that is coming up um, for... Uh, and this is passionate love this is intimacy this is romance um, this is um, the sense of um, your partner um, whether you are married or not married okay so um, this energy is here on Monday and that is water energy emotion on Tuesday you have the energy of celebration which is going to be wonderful good positive so um, if there was a situation where you two were, um, you know, separated for a time or that sort of a thing, there is a huge celebration that is coming in and it's going to be a positive one. It's going to be a healing of um, maybe past art and conflicts. Um, each party seems to be understanding each other and this is going to be good because the Three of Cups is always getting back together and uh, um, celebrating that um, getting back together and it is celebrating in a very positive way okay so that is also good so let's see what's happening on Wednesday on Wednesday we have the energy of the Pentacles and let's see um, this is the six of um, Pentacles the six of Pentacles this is good because help is coming in um, you know it's as if um, you are giving help and that person is helping you so help is coming in and this is going to be wonderful for the energy of the six of Pentacles and then on Thursday let's see what we have on Thursday we have justice on Thursday we have justice so this is wonderful this is positive this is going to be very good this is going to be positive very 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 positive okay so let's look and see what is happening on Friday for you guys you have the energy of the king of swords energy of the king of swords you know who that is an old man over the age of 40 and um, there is a situation and then we have heartbreak and the heartbreak um, with the energy of the king of swords and then let's look and see what we have we have the wheel of fortune yes it is the wheel of fortune okay so um, let's see what is happening here let's see what is going to be the energy in the six week for the Capricorns what is going to be the energy the six weeks for the Capricorns um, um, I need to put my glasses on <laughs> and you for um, the Capricorns in the six week is a seven of ones um, in reverse you're not protecting yourself properly so you need to start protecting yourself properly okay so um, in this week this is um, you know your your energy of uh, um, you're not protecting yourself properly and you need to really protect yourself properly in this week so okay let's go ahead let's look let's see what is going on what is going on so on Monday the energy of the lovers and on Tuesday you know you're celebrating together whatever that is and um, what I'm receiving is that the energy of the lovers is um, a positive energy and whatever that has transpired whatever whoever had gone or tried to get um, in between um, the energy of the lovers because there is a situation with the king of sword the king of sword is someone who is affecting most of you and this is someone who is an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libra who is affecting you um, in the way of um, you know intervening in your life um, um, so to be and you need um, to 
remove this person whatever is happening with the energy of the lovers it's very good because there is really really a sense of celebration um, the cup run it over and there is fashion there is a lot of passion that is coming up for the energy of the lovers and then you have the energy of the six of Pentacles so there is going to be a give and take and this week whatever the situation that is arising um, the middle of the week um, is the energy of justice in the middle of the week it is the energy of justice this energy of justice if you're having a legal suit or legal situation is going to be a win-win for you Capricorns okay it's going to be a win-win situation for you Capricorns whatever that is happening and whatever that is transpiring because here you are seeing um, whatever injustice that was there it's going to be a win-win the energy of um, um, the um, this person because um, whatever has um, transpired there is going to be a give and take and a win-win of the situation because obviously it is a situation that is um, a karmatic situation because the wheel of fortune is here okay so let's look and see what else is happening um, the Queen of Wands whoever this Queen of Wands is stay away from her because there is a situation with a queen of wands this queen of wands um, is as if um, some of you have uh, or seen someone who is with someone and the person can be an Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius okay and um, there's absolutely no passion he, uh, he or she has no passion with this person and um, it's as if someone is going to tell because this queen, this king of swords, and then you know, he's not a really nice person. I think he is going to tell her of this person having an affair with you, and this is what is transpiring, this is what is happening. So, um, here you see that, um, whatever is happening you both are going to overcome the situation because um, the whoever you you know whether you're a man or a woman you're seeing someone who is either a cancer or a Gemini okay you're seeing someone who's either a cancer or a Gemini and this person um, is really into you and um, this person is in love with you and um, they're actually in another relationship with the Queen of Wands and the Queen of Wands is an Aries a Leo or Sagittarius but the King of Sword is going to um, let this person be aware of the, the situation but in the outcomes it's going to be as victorious success because um, whoever the your partner is because your partner can be a, a Gemini or a Cancer Whoever this person is, it's going to be a relief for him because at least she's going to know that lesson. You know, he's in love with someone else. So for him, it is a celebration that, um, um, you know, she know that he is in love with someone else because whoever is this um, King of Sword is going to tell this lady about this relationship. And, you know, um, whoever your partner is, it's going to be happy that, you know, they did it because, um, what is happening is that you know she knows that there is someone else and he needs to um, spend some time with this person so whatever is transpiring um it's as if he's he's thinking to himself you know i really don't care if they tell her because uh, you know at least um she will know that there is someone else and that i'm in love with someone else because obviously um it is a passion whatever he feels for you he or she whatever he or she feels for you and remember this person can be a cancer or a Gemini whatever he or she feels for you it is a sense of passion it is as if you have known each other in um, you know lifetimes and lifetimes so let's move on and see what else is happening because the energy of heartbreak is here so um, what else is happening the ace of cups so there is um <laughs> the ace of cups so the energy of heartbreaks is 
here and what is transpiring and what is happening um, in the middle of the week it is uh, a celebration and then heartbreaks and then the six of Pentacles but the ace of cups comes up and it comes up upright whenever the ace of cups comes up and it comes up upright there is new love that is coming in and um, this can um, mean that it is the sense of a baby from this person you know and um, there is new love and this can be a baby that the partner is you know with this that you know um, the partner the person could be pregnant and a new love new love is always baby and is as if the celebration is here but he's heartbroken because he cannot be with the love of his life and this is what is happening because he has to be um preparing and make sure that um he is balancing out his relationship at home but yet still he's preparing and trying to figure out um, how is he going to balance and there's a heartbreak because even though this new baby is here he wants to be with the love of his life and it's as if I didn't ask for this you know and he's not cursing or whatever but he's he's saying to himself I didn't ask for this because you know the person tricked him or she the person has tricked him or she and what is happening here is that um, you are like he you know she has this new baby and his heart and your heart is broken because you both cannot be together and his love doesn't lie by her but it lies by you okay so you know this is good because um, whoever this person is and and whatever is going on this woman was not being honest in the first place it's as if um, he was with this woman and she says oh I can't get pregnant and then all of a sudden she gets pregnant and then she has a child so she used the child to hold him and that sort of a thing and this is exactly what is happening so um, what is happening what can I say to you if love is passionate and you're passionate about this person and you feel the same way about this person um, do I say to you hold on and maybe and now I I'm, I'm really gonna say to you you know um, step back from this situation and um, you know there's always and you know sometimes you think um, that is only what that life has to offer you but it's not what life has to offer you there is you know look at yourself as being better three of ones is in a reverse okay weird <laughs> um okay all right let's 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 ask a question here okay because um you ha you're giving and receiving you're giving and receiving there's energy of justice and then you have the wheel of fortune and oh now i understand there is no heartbreaks there is no heartbreaks um you are, are moving forward I just need to understand what is happening here the six of ones you're handing something and you're moving forward okay you're ending something and you're moving forward let's um, see what is happening here and the next energy you have is a two of cups there is there is really love I, I you know whatever is happening between you and this person this is going to be the knight of sword is coming it is with any uh, energy of justice and the queen of uh, cups is in the reverse whoever the queen of cups is uh, um, five of pentacles is here okay um and there's a judgment called so wow all right um most of you want to end the relationship most of you decide to end the relationship um but um is this going to happen 
because it's as if this relationship is a karmatic relationship energy of justice in the king of sword and that sort of a thing um, the art break is now in reverse whatever the situation is that was transpiring but what I'm seeing is the two of cups with the ace of cups which is there is new love coming in for you both again this you know whoever this person is she finds out about the relationship and you have stopped this relationship you have decided not to go any further with this relationship and um, you two really have this close close bond because the celebration and the giving and taking it is two people are trying to connect together and giving and taking but the the, the, the most um, the central point to say of your reading is new love and this new love um, you you whoever this person is is not really happy about this new baby comes in because he realized that it is the end of the road for him because he has to be there as a father he has to be there to be given and taken and he feels so trapped he or she feels so trapped in this relationship because this was not what he wanted there is just so much heartbreaks that is all over the floor there is um, so many heartbreaks that is happening because this person was not and 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 did not um, you know come up to um, you know this was not what he wanted because it's as if he was with someone because he's with the person but then the person kind of manipulates him in a situation and um, and now and 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 yeah now it is a, a situation where um, uh, there are things happening where you know you want to end this situation and move on you really don't want to be in this situation anymore because you're seeing you're you know you're thinking you lay your bed you have make your bed you have laid your bed and I don't want to be a part of it and you are walking away from this okay and you're there thinking you're thinking um, what is it I should do what is it uh, what should I do um, how should I move on from this okay so you're thinking because you you basically wants to end it um, you basically wants to end it because you don't you are not seeing a future to this and you know to be honest to be honest people if if someone you basically wants to you know there's a lot of things and a lot of people and a lot of situation that is coming but there is new love that is coming for most of you because this is not happening to all of you there is new love that is coming there's new um, partnerships that are coming out um, there is the three of the three of uh, um, sword is here which is the energy of heartbreak there's uh, there's heartbreak but there's new love so it's as if uh, um, you walk away from this situation and something much better comes in okay um, I would say to you okay this is my advice and I would say if a man gets himself in a situation like this he's no man at all okay if a woman gets herself in a situation like this she's no woman at all because if you don't want to have kids you just don't want to have kids the energy of the air event um, the air energy of the air event so um, this is what is uh, moving you from out of uh, this week in um, in the new week the energy of the elephant what is the elephant organization situation um, um, you know business partner and that sort of a thing but what I should say about this reading because there is so much information into this reading it is uh, if you are in the situation where you're with someone who actually is having an is married to someone who is a fire sign or whatever um, let this person go because and don't feel heartbreak it heartbroken about it because what I'm seeing is ha hot passion but is there true love um, okay there could be true love because the energy of the two of cups three of cups and ace of cups is there which is it could be true love but on the other end because the six of cups is not here which is saying it could be a soulmate this is a as actually a soulmate relationship that you came back but this woman is there and now she has a new child coming in 
so she has manipulated this person and and, and it could be um, you manipulate someone or someone manipulates you but there is thir a third party you don't need to be a third party Capricorns okay Capricorns you don't need to be a third party move away from this situation if this person really cares about you um, they will find you okay I want to say to each and every person namaste until next week